どうもどうも、What is up, everybody? Welcome back. Steady here for another debut of a new manga. We've been getting a lot of、uh, new manga in、uh, Shonen Jump these days, and、uh, a lot of them have been actually very, very good. And I gotta say, it's an exciting time to be a Shonen Jump fan.、Uh, for a while there, obviously, it's.、Uh, It was a little hard to come by some、uh, good series, but we've been getting a lot of good stuff these days, you know, with、uh, Kaiju Number Eight, Mashal, Undead Unlock, and all these great new series. And we are here today for Phantom Seer.、Um, now, I, I am a big fan. If you don't know,、uh, you might recognize the art style of、uh, Matsuda Sensei. He's the one who drew、uh, Tokyo Shinobi Squad, which. I personally absolutely loved, although、uh, I would be remiss if I didn't、um, kind of agree with the criticisms about kind of like the way that the story went and things like that.、Uh, there was definitely something、uh, lacking.、Um, but for this series,、uh, Matsuda Sensei is working with someone different、uh, who covers the story side. So that, that, that's, actually,、uh, that's actually kind of what I was hoping, if I'm honest.、Um, and upon doing a little bit more research,、um, The,、uh, it seems that this、uh, Phantom Seer series、uh, in Japanese called Hono Mieru Shonen is、um, actually, I think a couple years ago, they won this one shot. It was actually a one shot that's turned into、uh, serialization here. One kind of like,、uh, they call it the Mirai Hai, kind of like the up and coming manga of、uh, Shonen Jump and things like that. So it, it's、uh, got a lot of promise, so it's already been proven. Um, so, it's very exciting to see. And of course,、uh, you know, the theme kind of being like spirits and ghosts and things like that.、Uh, you know, of course, the running joke is that、uh, there's an another、uh, a spirit exorcism kind of manga, right? Of course, I covered Jutsu Kaisen as well. But this one definitely has to,、uh, apparently a little bit more to do with kind of paranormal and kind of like、uh, ghost photography and things like that, from what I've been told. Uh, which uh, I'm actually、um, not very much.、Uh, <laughs> if I have one weakness, it's definitely kind of like Japanese paranormal, like Juon and the Ring, and oh man, I, I cannot deal with that kind of stuff.、Um, you know, things like Saw and Chainsaw Massacre and things like that, Texas Chainsaw Man, I think those things are hilarious, but like things like this, it really kind of hits close to home, like, you know. Washing your face, and you look up and you see something in the mirror kind of, kind of those kind of things. Oh, no, but I'm gonna power through it. Yeah, I mean, the art style looks absolutely awesome here already. So let's open it up. Chapter 1 Phantom Seer. Get into the spirit of this ghostly manga. Halloween right around the corner, too. Pretty good, so it's perfect. Alright, here we go. Man, this already looks so awesome. There's a rumor going around. They say that if something strange and mysterious occurs, he's a guy you can rely on. That's cool. The, even the way that they've got the box on his face like that. Very cool. Oh, look at this、uh, color double page spread here. And I already like the,、uh, you know, the protagonist looks very cool, obviously.、Uh, pr pretty simple design, but effective,、uh, certainly with the white hair and all that. And kind of the female protagonist here,、um, the heroine, so to speak. I, Matsuda Sensei really,、um, you know, it's subjective art style and stuff, but really for me, I really like the way that、um, even in、uh, Tokyo Shinobi Squad, Which I'm embarrassed because I forget the name, but there was that girl who was a really cool design as well. But this,、uh, this looks cool. This looks cool.、Uh, so, the story is by Togo Goto. <laughs> I like the name kind of the. <laughs> In Japanese, of course, it doesn't really. Goto Togo. Oh, it does. Yeah. It's kind of like an anagram. I think anagram is the right word. But yeah, and Kento Matsuda, right? Phantom Seer Chapter 1 The Boy with Psychic Power. I love helping people. Did you fall? Yeah. Oh, she's a nice, nice girl. There you go. You should be fine now. My dad's a police officer and my mom's a nurse. With parents like that, helping people in need comes naturally to me. Oh, wow. <laughs> 
So if I can be of some help and get a smile as well, then I feel really happy. And I can do one special thing. Oh, what's going on? Wait, stop. Riku. Riku. Look at the glass is broken. Ah, the glass just broke on its own. I have this mysterious ability to sense danger. Oh, she's got like a spidey sense kind of thing going on. Riku rescued me again. I'm glad I noticed in time. Remember the time when a driverless car almost ran us over? Your sixth sense is amazing. Maybe you have psychic abilities. Well, she's got uh, she's got ghost abilities, right? Probably. Yeah, I wonder why, but I'm happy it lets me help people. I saw what you just did. Riku Aibetsu. Riku Aibetsu. Oh, cool. Look at this art. Uh, rub, rub. I have something to talk to you about, so stop by the empty, empty classroom later. Am I seeing things? If you don't want to come, that's fine too. Hey, is that the guy people have been talking about? Yeah. He's the boy with psychic powers. Oh, so he's like an actual student at the school. I thought he was just like... So the thing that crashing through the window must have been like a ghost or something, right? I'm here. Iori Katanagi. Katanagi. Iori. Iori. Iori, Iori always reminds me of um, uh, King of Fighters. <laughs> What's with the classroom? It looks weird. Oh, I need it this way. I'm usually here during break periods. Uh, okay. That said, why'd you show up? Uh, he's got the face going on. Uh, because you told me to? <laughs> Normally people don't come when a stranger asks them to go somewhere. Uh, yeah, that's true. That's not true. If I wasn't planning on coming, I would have said so right there and then. It'd be rude to keep you waiting without saying anything. Oh, <laughs> you're very polite. I respect that. <laughs> you're being sarcastic, aren't you? Uh, but I heard that you have psychic powers and you help people. No way. Oh, sorry. It was the girl talking. But I heard that you have psychic powers and you help people. No way. Huh? I don't do anything for others. I only do things for myself. Then, why'd you ask to see me? Is he ignoring me? Uh, did you just take a photo? Uh-oh. There's gonna be a ghost, right? Well, this is the kind of stuff that I hate. <laughs> so, this is what I wanted you to talk about. Oh! Damn. That's pretty intense. Oh. Aibetsu, there's a phantom haunting you. Oh. What is this? A ghost? No, it's a phantom. Phantom? We call these non-humans that cause strange things to ha happen phantoms. Sometimes these phantoms haunt humans and take their lives. Whoa. Phantoms normally can't be seen, but if you go to places with some kind of past or do something out of the ordinary, you might bump into them and see them. It seems you've encountered a phantom. You can't be serious. There's someone who wants to talk to you. Me? Who? She's the one who told me about your phantom and wanted me to talk to you. My older sister. Oh, cool. We're already getting kind of like uh, side characters and stuff. Bzzz. Oh, Isn't the timing a little too convenient? Oh, right. Don't worry about that. That's what she does. Hi, sis. Whoa. Hello, my bratty little brother. Being able to see a phantom's not good, especially if you can see its full form. For now, it's just the face, but if left alone, it will become a big problem. How can, how can you tell all that from just the photo? Nice to meet you, Riku. She knows my name. This design is very cool. The drawing, the art style is just totally up my alley. I love this. I hear you have sharp senses. Y yes, I can sense when there's danger. How does she know all of this? I see. I was hoping you might might have seen it before. What? The woman's face from the photo. Woman's face? A woman looking at me on the train. Is that it? No, that person was outside the train. Oh, creepy. On the outside of a moving train? Yes, outside of a moving train, yeah. This is also very like a typical like setting for, I've seen like a couple of those paranormal photos where you see like a face in a, typically like in a window or in a mirror or something like that. It's just the, 
I only saw her for a moment, so I thought my eyes were playing tricks on me. But that doesn't seem to be the case. You better go check it out. There it is. Got it, Aibetsu? Got it. Katanagi. <laughs> They're like, she's all about it. She's going for it. Then off you go. Katanagi. <laughs> I thought you were going to come with me. What are you talking about? If I did that, the phantom would haunt me. <laughs> He's really angry. I like these faces. This is a, a little bit more of a departure from what we saw in Tokyo Shinobi Squad in terms of like the expressions and stuff. So it's okay for me, but it's already haunting you. Uh, but it's already haunting you, so it's too late for you. Don't say such horrible things so casually. Anyways, I don't plan on being involved, Iori. Of course, you're going with her. <laughs> oh no. Your younger brother looks really shocked. That's not what we discussed. You said all I needed to do was bring Ibits into this room. I take it back. <laughs> you're a demon for playing around with an innocent boy's heart. An innocent boy. <laughs> These faces are great. I'm not giving in. I don't care what you say, big sis. I'll abandon Ibitsa like it's nothing. How can you say such awful things? What's wrong with you? I see. Iori. So you're not going. Uh oh, she's messing with the room. What are these talismans coming off? I'll go with her. <laughs> he gave in so quickly. Jeez, this guy is really expressive. Like, you know, considering the simple design, he's very expressive. So that's one way to cover the kind of simpler design for sure. She's horrible. She knows I could never go against her orders. He, uh, he handed me his phone. These siblings make me nervous. It's fine, Iku. Please don't read my thoughts. <laughs> oh, so she's got some sort of like telepathic thing going on. Iori pretty much has the personality of scum, but <laughs> wow, you called him scum. Despite his appearance, he's a legit shaman. Shaman. Now off you go. Time's running out. It's your fault, it's your fault, it's your fault. <laughs> wow, this is, this is pretty funny. Oh right, your sister said you're a shaman. To put it simply, shamans are people with special abilities who can exercise phantoms. Special abilities? Wow, people in that line of work help people, right? <laughs> She's so impressed. Why would you assume that? I mean, you can help people in trouble with phantoms, right? That's incredible. I've always wanted to find a way to use my danger sensing ability to help others. Maybe this is the way. Wow, she's really like, she's on board. <laughs> I see, yeah. One thing, Abitsu, don't overestimate what you can do. Special abilities can be fickle and hard to control. Oh, stop it, you're scaring me. Oh, something's about to happen. For now, just let me know as soon as I can sense danger so I can run away. You're just using me. And for the worst reasons. The worst reasons? The only reason I'm here is because that big sis threat threatened me. He's still angry about that. Listen, my sister is one of the top shamans in the country. Cool, so already kind of building the world a little bit, right? Kind of promise of uh, other characters. So she's a pretty big deal. She's not just a big deal, she's a monster. That's why I can never stand up to her. I end up doing whatever she bids. <laughs> I have no interest in helping you, Abetsu. Uh, it'd be nice if you could... Oh, she's sensing that. It's got the spidey sense going on. Abetsu, what's this feeling? Something's not right. Oh. Katanagi, the people around us have disappeared. Uh oh, the train is also stopped. Isn't that... It isn't that the people around us disappeared. We've entered another realm. Oh, they got pulled into like a phantom realm. Or more like we've been beckoned in. We didn't see its entire body in the photo, so I didn't think things would escalate so quickly. The emergency button. Maybe we can connect. I don't expect it'll work, but I guess we can try. Oh. Abitsu? They're looking this way. Oh no. She's super scared. They're watching us? Who's watching? Too many. There's too many. Oh my gosh. But there's no one here. No, they're here. Whoa! Damn! Outside the train, look at all the little eyeballs. And they got the cute little hands there. <laughs> Deek, there's so many. A lot of phantoms have gathered, unless... Sis, could this be? Yes, it might be that Iori. Uh, she's got some sort of like... 
medium power. She's a, like a medium, right? You gotta be kidding me, Katanagi. These phantoms targeting me, your Riku. Your hopes and your talents may not necessarily align. For example, even though a person might want to be an athlete, their talents can mean they're better suited to be an artist. What are you talking about? Big sis. Even though you want to help people, your ability might actually put the people around you in danger. What? She actually uh, pulls, pulls phantoms instead, right? What do you mean? What you see are poltergeists. Phantoms that only cause small annoyances. A lot of the danger you've been sensing is the threat caused by these poltergeists gathering around you. The glass just broke, a driverless car almost. So in another words, in another words, your power attracts phantoms. Yeah, okay. You were just sensing the danger you were attracting. You were drawing other people into danger instead of helping them. Oh no. I was, listen, Abitsu. Even now. Oh no, she's... Get away. Don't get yourself in danger. Oh damn, what the? Whoa, I did not expect that page. That's pretty... That's a turn the page and it's like, whoa. That's pretty intense, okay. This is like, I can deal with it. <laughs> sort of. <laughs> I'm sorry, Katanagi. Oh no. Run. Oh, jeez. So that must be the uh, woman's face that she saw. Oh, that was an Okubi. If that's the woman Aibetsu saw, then that photo, the face, is the entire is the entire body. Oh, so it's a it's a phantom that where the face is the whole body, I guess. Good, Iori, are you going? If I said I didn't want to, you just force me, anyways. I'm only doing this because I have to. I'm sorry, run, but I feel a little motivated now. Oh. Huff, huff, huff. Damn, this art is intense. Wow. Uh, we're on page 38, by the way. Have I been the one attracting these monsters? Oh, man. Riku rescued me again. Riku rescued me again. I, I said that before, too, and I caught it. I was like... Riku rescue. <laughs> I was the one involved. Uh, I was the one involved everyone. I was the one who involved everyone in all of this. Sorry, just a little typo, I think. I'm the one making trouble. Oh no. Damn, look at this. Katanagi, why? Your hopes and your talents may not necessarily align. Yeah, I remember. I mean, of course, in Tokyo Shinobi Squad, some of the, uh, the action cuts were just really amazing, so cool to see that they can use it in uh, Phantom Seer as well. Oh no, it looks like um, Katanagi got his uh, back cut too. I understand you, Aibetsu, because I'm the same. What? Shadow is healing his wounds. Whoa, cool. Truthfully, I just wanted to be a normal ki kid who has nothing to do with phantoms. Whoa. Damn, look at this. He's got like shadow, shadow abilities. Like, you know who. <laughs> But my talents make me suited to being a shaman. A shaman uses the powers of phantoms to expel other phantoms. Using curses to dispel curses. <laughs> Sorry, I can't help myself, but yeah, I mean that that's that's what's gonna happen. I mean it's typical. In my case, I possess the power to control shadows. Cool. In other words, I possess a really dangerous phantom. Damn! Look at that cool it's almost like um i have the uh mask from uh from my uh, go uh, ghost of uh, tsushima let's play very cool damn that's cool this is the shadow demon ongyogi ongyoki oh ongyoki yeah it's um if you've played Neo, you see a lot. Like these are all based on like yokai and things like that, right? If I keep him out for too long, he goes crazy. So let's get this over with quickly. Oh. Show them your power. Yori, you say I'm a monster, but you're the one who can con control Ongyoki, a demon no one else could tame. Damn. You're a monster in your own right. Oh, shadow step. There's no escape. 
Once Ongyoki steps on your shadow, you can't move. To be honest, I can't afford uh, for you to escape. If there's no prey when I summon him, then he'll take my life. Oh. Damn. Look at that. All these shadow arms and stuff coming out. Damn, look at this. Page 46 and 47, double spread. Wow. Whoo! Damn, the sword through the... Gee, this is cool. I feel bad for you, Okubi. Both you and I ran into the wrong enemy. Oh, damn. So the Ongyoki took the Okubi back into the... Uh, damn, very cool. I like the I like the little panels on the bottom here 49 how it's kind of like yeah, that's cool is it over yeah katanagi what was that don't worry about it let's go Aibetsu is it okay for me to go back I attract phantoms right if I go back I'll just end up causing people uh, trouble for other people I think it's okay for a painter to want to become an athlete you can still try to live a normal life, even if you have a powerful phantom haunting you. You can still want to help others, even if you attract phantoms. Oh. Your hopes and your talents may not necessarily align, but that doesn't mean you have to deny your feelings. You don't have to deny yourself. Oh, a shonen job. <laughs> yeah, this is a cool, uh, cool art style. Um, yeah, Katanagi, thanks, like I said. I'm gonna be a normal kid. <laughs> I like this guy. Katanagi. All right, I'm done now, sis. Okay, I'm going home. <laughs> and right as I was thinking, he said some really good things. <laughs> Hi, sis. Yori, from now on, make sure you keep protecting Riku. <laughs> yeah, okay, so. What are you talking about, sis? You expelled the Okubi, but Riku is gonna keep attracting phantoms, right? People like her are known as beckoning hands. Oh. The rule states that when a beckoning hand is uh, found, we must protect them. So we need to protect her. But someone else can do it, right? I absolutely refuse to take on that role. I want to be a normal kid. I want my freedom. Your freedom? Okay. But first, you need to become stronger than me. <laughs> then you won't ever have to listen to what I say. <laughs> <laughs> That's not the point. That's impossible anyways. <laughs> Katanagi, Aibetsu. And this is how my relationship to that strange psychic boy began. Why don't you just stay here? Don't return. <laughs> You're horrible. Cool. Oh man, I'm, I'm loving it. I mean, uh, you know, there is something I, I, I can understand. Like when I say like I don't like... Uh, kind of uh, paranormal stuff and things like that it's it's i mean like i can totally understand the kind of the rush of seeing scary things and stuff like that i get it um and of course this is like this is you know this is shown in manga so it's not like super super intense right and it's just manga so yeah th this is really cool of course the some of these action shots are all oh, intense and the character design of course matsuda sensei uh, you know I'm sure talks with the, the person in charge of the story and things like that to come up with these designs and stuff. But I remember with Tokyo and Shinobi Squad, that was one thing that was just so cool. Um, and of course here, it, the Ongyoki looks really cool too. Yeah, and some of these, uh, some of the drawings and I, I really love how expressive the faces and stuff are. But yeah, I mean, uh, I... I I think I'm going to be reading this one every week and I might do a little reaction video every week too. Uh, maybe make a little, uh, another uh, little manga lounge series out of this one. Um, but yeah, it's, uh, let me know what you guys thought. Uh, of course, uh, thank you very much for uh, coming by, taking some time out of your day to watch and, uh, hey, we will see you in the next video. All right, man, showing and jump on a roll these days. Cheers to you. You know how we do, Mata Yoroshiku!